This video will go over two different methods of importing loads into Mechanical for static structural analysis from various other analyses. First, we'll go through the internal connections in Workbench from one analysis to the next. Here I have a completed static thermal analysis with a temperature source on the top and a cooler surface on one side of the flange. The temperature differential caused by this can be seen in the results section. To analyze the structural effects of these thermal results, we need to run a static structural analysis. To do so, let's go back into Workbench, click and drag a static structural analysis onto the solution section of the thermal analysis. We can then see that the engineering data, geometry and mesh have been copied and the thermal results feed into the setup of the static structural analysis. If we double click on setup to open mechanical, we can see that the tree on the right has both thermal and static structural analysis shown. Under structural, if we expand the imported load and update the imported temperature, we will see that it matches the results from the thermal analysis. We can quickly set some boundary conditions in the form of fixed supports on both ends of the body, add in a deformation and equivalent stress results and hit solve. Once completed, we can then easily visualize the structural effects of the imported thermal loads.